Well, it's true to say East meets West today. That's East London against West London, West Ham against Chelsea. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary position, and my partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. Stuart, he used to play for West Ham, albeit at the old Upton Park as opposed to this modern London stadium. Well, I actually picked up Player of the Year award in 1988 when playing for West Ham against Chelsea. It was a big day. We won the game 4-1, and Chelsea were relegated. So I've got good memories of the game. Hopefully that's the case again today. Well, let's see what happens. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players. He can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. And a look at the West Ham 11. The experienced Lukasz Fabianski stands between the posts. Kurt Zuma plays with Tilo Keira in central defence. Declan Rice starts alongside Tomasz Socek in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Kepa is the goalkeeper. Thiago Silva plays alongside Kalidou Koulibaly in central defence. Hakim Ziyech plays with Mason Mount on the flanks. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And now they get the ball rolling. So check. On to Paqueta. Said Benrama. Paqueta. So check. Very quick thinking there. Kai Havertz. On the ball, Zakaria. Might really be able to trouble them here. Must take the lead here. Really important tackle. Skamaka. Jared Bowen. Well read to ease the pressure. Mount and now Havertz might be a chance here and tremendous goalkeeping well he just made it so difficult for the striker his presence alone just caused him a problem It's a short one. Ziyech. Did look as though they might be onto something for a second or so. And there the attack ends for now. Kurt Zuma. Skamaka. Delightful pass. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the position they were in. Havertz, perfect challenge. Zakaria. Opportunity in the wide area. Mount. And that changes the dynamic.
Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. So underway again here, 1-0 the score. Paqueta, good tackle. Zakaria, it's with Hakim Ziyech. Oh, good play this, and narrowly off target here. Well, it's still all to play for, but that was a good effort, wasn't it? Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. How about the cross? Havertz. And here's Ziyech. Zakaria. Nicely timed tackle. be able to profit from the wide position and with that the attack fizzles out can they do something positive on the counter attack and this might not be the ideal situation for them oh dealt with by the goalkeeper Can he deliver it with accuracy? And still dangerous. Determined defending. Well, it's official now. The first 45 minutes have come and gone here at the London Stadium. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. Well, the referee sounding the second half into action and Chelsea with the lead here. Very timely interception. Declan Rice. Gianluca Scamacca. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. Oh, well, fair enough. That's a good recovery. Mount. On the ball, Zakaria. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. Zakaria. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come onto them. Only one possession back. What can they do from here?
Could he doing a fine job of protecting the ball? Declan Rice. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Havertz. And now passing it through. And hunting for his second goal tonight, however. Well, you're absolutely right. He's been on great form today. That was another good effort. Playing it short. And they kick the ball. Advantage Chelsea. It opens up for Havertz. And Chelsea have done it. It's going to be so difficult to stop them now. Well, here it is. 1v1 against the keeper and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. So the ball rolling again, 2-0. Jared Bowen. Declan Rice. Gianluca Scamacca. Perfect challenge. Well, Chelsea have had so much possession, as you can see, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Well, let's see if they can win the ball back and create something else. Cleared away comprehensively. Just 15 minutes remaining. Kurt Zuma. Rice with it. Just the challenge that was required. Encouraging move from West Ham. Well, approaching full time, and this is wearing the look of Mission Impossible for the home side, Stuart. Well, there are two main reasons why they're losing this game. Firstly, they've not shown enough desire to close the opposition down. And secondly, they haven't defended their box well enough. It's been a poor defensive display. So check. Press well. Oh, great defending. Excellent vision. Now the attack fizzled out. Skamaka. For Niles. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Corner kick played in. Presswell. And there goes the final whistle. An altogether frustrating experience for West Ham and their supporters. Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the ball in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out. Well, a standout performance from Kai Havertz. Not for the first time, you've got to say. Stuart, he really turned on the style.
Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?